Oh, hey everybody. Welcome back to another wood shape video. Glad to have you here today. Stick around and I'm going to show you how to make one of these laptop stands. We'll see you at the end. I started by ripping the panels for the stand from three quarter inch plywood and this was the pure bond plywood that I had left over from the French cleat project. Now describing the dovetails, I did use a dovetail marker. You don't necessarily need a dovetail marker, you can use a bevel gauge or some type of angled rule. Chiseling out the uh, scribed lines here for the dovetails so that when I do the saw, a hand saw, it will stay on the line and so I don't get any chipping. You know, I know that it's difficult as it is doing dovetails, let alone with plywood, and most people probably would not attempt to do something like this. Well, maybe they do, I don't know. but. I like the look of the plywood, so I'm giving it a shot nonetheless. I chose to cut my dovetails with my Japanese saw. I then proceeded to chisel out the material. Time to join the panels together and I did use Type Bond 2 glue and just use the mallet to knock them together. I sanded starting with 80 grit and then I just went straight to 220 grit and I sanded enough to of course make it smooth but also to take off some of the plywood layers just to give it some extra character. I then proceeded to scribe lines on the laptop stand to center the holes for the ventilation of the laptop. And I got to drilling. Final step was four coats of Minwax Clear Brush On Lacquer.
Hey everybody, I really hope you enjoyed that video as much as I enjoyed the project. This was my first attempt at doing dovetails, so please leave a comment below and let me know what you thought of the project. Like the video. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Um, you're going to want to see my future videos. So until next time, remember to go shake some wood, and we'll see you again soon.